10 tips for getting a girlfriend imagine waking up next to a woman who is incredible beautiful that you wonder if you're already awake or if you're still dreaming imagine looking into the eyes of the girl who understands you who shares a life with you and who just gets you so many men dreams about a happy relationship with a girl of their dreams so many men lie awake at night thinking about how it could be to have a girlfriend who loves them who supports them and who is there for them the sad truth is that for a lot of them this desire will remain nothing but the dream not because they are particularly ugly or because they are not rich enough no the real reason why a lot of men have extremely hard time getting the girlfriend they truly want and truly deserve has everything to do with how they act and how they don't act they do the wrong things and make the difference decision while they try to bypass the steps that will make all the difference this has to change what i want to share with you today is a step-by-step -step plan to getting a girlfriend and yes it requires some emotional investments but once applied it can lead to an amazing relationship with a woman of your dreams welcome la chiefie before we begin with the video of today i create and publish new videos every day so be sure to subscribe for more great videos that being said let's jump into the video number one be happy without girlfriend listen here you will never be able to attract the girlfriend you truly want as long as you are not happy being the person you are. Hollywood loves to fool you with emotional statements like, I can't live without you, and you complete me. But the truth is that, emotionally healthy, happy girls run away as soon as they meet a guy who isn't on the same emotional level. It's on you if you ignore this advice. And Number 2. Imagine your perfect girlfriend. Close your eyes and imagine your perfect girlfriend. Seriously, close your eyes now and imagine her. How does she look like? How does she talk? How does she move? How does she feel? How does she treat you? How does she treat herself? Don't be one of those guys who want just a girlfriend. Be the guy who says, I want my girlfriend. You deserve the girlfriend that you really want and the first step to get her is to imagine her. If visualization can help professional athletes to win gold medals, it can help you to find out which girl is worth settling for. Once you have a clear picture of her, it's time to make a promise. Number 3. Promise yourself that you won't settle for less. Promise yourself that you won't make the same mistake that so many other men make. Sign it with your blood that you won't end up in a relationship for the following reasons. Number 1. She has a vagina, so she must be perfect for me. Number two, she's interested in me, so why not giving it a shot? Number three, I am lonely, so I should make her my girlfriend. Unfortunately, these are the most popular reasons why men end up in relationships. These are also the main reason why so many men walk around with the look. Number four, learn the fundamentals. I don't say that you can't be successful with women without starting the art of seduction. You can, but it can take a long, long time. Most dating coaches took the path with the most struggle and resistance by approaching hundreds, if not hundreds of women. And by going on countless dates, I did that too, at least until I also attend a coaching program. Don't be shy. Don't hesitate to learn from the people who have figured it out the hard way. Learning the fundamentals of meeting, approaching, attracting, and seducing women are immensely important. At least when you don't want to end up like the guys that I talked about under point 3. Number 5. Cross borders to find her. Do you want a perfect girlfriend? Are you willing to do whatever it takes to get her? I never really wanted to be together with one of those nagging girls whose main hobbies are complaining, make fun of their boyfriends, and talking in such an aggressive way that your ears start to hurt after talking to them for 5 minutes. Some of my friends settle for them, which I will never fully understand, but I wanted more. I want a supportive, beautiful, and nurturing girlfriend. Are you ready to do the same? You always need to leave your comfort zone to find the girl of your dreams and sometimes you even need to leave the borders of your home country. There are over 3.5 billion women in the world and the further you are willing to go, the more likely it is that you meet the special someone on the way. 
Number six, don't settle for the first girl. No matter if you decide to travel the world in search of a perfect girl, meet as many women as possible can and go as many dates as you can fit in your calendar. Will the first girl you approach be your soulmate? Probably not. Will the fifth girl you approach be your soulmate? Highly unlikely. Will the hundredth girl you approach be your soulmate? You are getting there. And please, 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 don't settle for the first girl who smiles at you, who goes on a date with you, or who sleeps with you. A smile or a date and sex are not the best indicators for a happy relationship. The same values, the same beliefs, similar interests, and similar idea of the future are what really matters. Number 7. Present your authentic self. The best way to find out if a woman has the same beliefs, similar interests, and a similar idea of the future is to show her your authentic self. I mean, you can pretend to be an extroverted party monster because you want to turn the hot alcoholic party chick into your girlfriend. But is that really what you want as the introverted guy you are? What many guys don't realize is that a girl might be fun for a night, but a nightmare for more than a week. Some women are just not good for you. Due to the fact that it is your goal to find a perfect girlfriend, authenticity is a must. You might be able to pretend to be someone you're not for a day or two, but you won't be able to do it for a year or two. And even if you'll be able to pretend to be someone you're not, do you really want it? Number 8. Be honest with your intentions. What do you want from your new girlfriend? I guess you want a lot of things. You want that she supports you. You want to feel loved and make her feel loved. You want to make her smile. You want to experience unforgettable memories with her. You want to do all those things, but you also want to touch her. You want to kiss her. You want to sleep with her. Of course, you can hide these intentions, but I guarantee you that it will put you directly into the friend zone. Sexuality is an important aspect of every relationship. So don't hide your sexual intent and make sure that you are sexually compatible. If you absolutely love blowjobs and she has to puke whenever she comes near your dick, she might not be the perfect girl for you. Yes, you heard me. Number 9. Find out if she is the right one. How do you find out if she is the right one for you? No matter if it's on a sexual, emotional and intellectual level. Shut up and listen. Listen to what she says. Listen to how she talks about certain things. Listen to her non-verbal signs and the way she interacts with you and with others. Are you in the same things? Does she have the same beliefs? Does she treat you and others with respect? What does she talk about when she talks about her future? Those are all important questions that you can answer by showing interest, being patient and by listening to the words she says. Number 10. Allow her to love you. You are 100% sure that she is the right girl for you. She thinks like you, she behaves like you, she even smells like you. Okay, that will be weird, right? But you get the point. Now it's time to open your doors and allow her to become part of your life. No, I am not talking about opening your legs and showing her your doings. I'm talking about opening the doors to your heart. One of the main diseases in the seduction community is the inability to love and to give love. Being a player and banging a bunch of chicks you have absolutely no feelings for is one thing. But connecting with a woman on a such deep emotional level that you have to force yourself to make an emotional striptease is another thing. The best way to cure this disease is by doing two things. Number one, develop the ability to love yourself. Number two, realize that being in love is not a weakness or disease. Once you allow her to give you love, and once you allow yourself to give her the love she desires, she will have tears in her eyes whenever you give a kiss on the forehead and call her your girlfriend while you do it. Here is the summary of the 10 awesome tips for getting a girlfriend. Number 1. Be happy without a girlfriend. Number 2. Imagine your perfect girlfriend. Number 3. Promise yourself to not settle for less. Number 4. Learn the fundamentals. Number 5. Cross borders to find her. Number 6. Don't settle for the first girl. Number 7. Present your authentic self. Number 8. 
Be honest with your intentions. Number 9. Find out if she's the right one. Number 10. Allow her to love you. Okay, that's it for today's video guys. I hope you enjoy the video. If you really enjoy the video, please hit that like button and also subscribe for more daily great content. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Take care.